Shalom, 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 another GMS on the go in the news back with another lesson, quick hit, giving all praise, honor, and glory to the Heavenly Father and His only begotten Son, Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem Rakakwadash. Next double honors to the head apostle slash elder bishops of Great Millstone, the one that taught us the 100% truth according to the Bible. Peace, blessings, and safety to all you sincere items. Keep pushing, keep believing, keep the faith. Regardless of people here, forbear. States with the highest STDs, and I'm just going, you know, just, just getting it in right quick. This is what happens when the wicked rules the earth. This devil sleazy gives these women the liberty to become whores and ratchet prostitutes. You see, now, now look at look at the earth, man, being promiscuous. I Meaning they're, they're 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 sleeping with Tom, Dick, Harry, Larry, Curly Moe. One one woman just came out and said her body count, you know what I'm saying, is five thousand and plus. She didn't slept with over five thousand men. Are, are you serious? This one you get get articles like this. You see. When women go around sleeping with 100, 50, uh, 200, 300, 3,000, 4,000, 5,000, 6,000, 800, damn it, man. This is what happens. I want just, just some quick states with the highest STDs, sexual transmitted disease. If you didn't know what STD mean, I'm going to tell you, transmitted, transmitted sexual, sexual transmitted diseases, man. All right? The land, the land is full of whoredom, man. You see? Nothing but whoredom. And that's why the Lord got to come and burn it, man. And burn it, man. States with the highest STDs rates revealed. Out of look, look, it's out of control. You see that? It's out of control now. Why? Going right back to Job um, um 9 24. It says, says it's out of control. An epidemic. Look, 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 new data breakdowns by US News. So you ain't really got this going on in those um in in the Middle East, you know what I'm saying? You got some women being promiscuous and things of that nature, but not on the level as Babylon, America. You see, and this is this is the same thing that was going on in ancient Babylon. You see, nothing but confusion, man. All right, let's read on a little bit. Just something quick. I'm already at work. U.S. News and World Reports revealed that ten states with the highest, and this is just the states with the highest. You know what I'm saying? Pretty much every state. You got to be careful with who you mess with in every one of these states. You see. It says with the highest STD rate, little look, look, Mississippi was among the states on the list. So Mississippi is number 10, right? No, no. Matter of fact, hold on, hold on. Let's see. The U.S. in the midst of an out of control STD epidemic with cases of syphilis, gonorrhea, and chlamydia. Somebody on fire right about now. Somebody on fire right about now. You see, and on the rise nationwide, the Center for Disease Control and Prevention say gonorrhea cases spiked by 28 percent across the country in 21, while totaling syphilis cases soared by a staggering 74 percent. I want to jump down to them different states, though. You see, I want to name the states. Seven of the 10 states with the law with the highest rates were located below the Mason Dixon line, including North Carolina. Which cloaked at tenth. So you, so here in North Kakalaki, you, you Israelite men, you better strap the hell up. Now, North Carolina is number ten. All right, with a total STD rates of nine nine hundred and twenty two point two percent per one thousand residents. This shit is out crazy. Look, look, New Mexico was number nine. This is this is wicked. So we're gonna bring up some scriptures. Oh, that's wickedness, man. STDs everywhere. Say that it's, it's out. It's out of control, man. It's like because these women are fucking Tom, Dick, Harry, Larry, Curly, and Mo. Ain't nobody using rubbers. You know what I'm saying? Just spreading you uh, down in Houston. You know what I'm saying? It spiked. What was it? One hundred and twenty-four percent. How the hell did it spike? One hundred and twenty-four percent. Pretty much damn near every woman in Houston got a damn disease. You know what I'm saying? Herpes, syphilis, gonorrhea. You know, uh, A I D S, all, all the above, man. You just like, man, better be careful. New Mexico was ninth with the infection, infection rate of 
925 percent per 1,000. Look, look, with Arkansas as eighth. Arkansas, you look. When you go to New Mexico, be, strap up. North Carolina, strap up. New Mexico, strap up. Look, look. While Arkansas, down in Arkansas, you know what I'm saying? Them bitches got diseases down there too. Look, look. They was in the eighth. Look, look. Here, here we go in Georgia. Georgia, Georgia. Just burning every damn thing moving, man. Georgia was in seventh spot. According to the analysts, with rates of chlamydia particularly pronounced in the Peach State, damn, dead, dead in the damn city. You see, eight in the damn ATL, when women in the damn ATL just spreading diseases like hell, right? Their chlamydia infection rates were six point. 6291 point you see it far higher than other states which had more std cases overall we're just gonna keep rolling right quick we're just gonna read down through a little meanwhile alabama and south dakota were sixth and fifth we just read down look, look they go to south kakalaki you know what i'm saying you know you know them h to the o's down there you know what i'm saying i'm surprised florida ain't been ain't up here yet south carolina ranked fourth you know what i'm saying fourth with the disease be careful look, look all up there in alaska was cold as shit alaska Alaska was third spot, man. You see, Alaska was in number three. You know what I'm saying Louisiana. You know what I'm saying uh, New New Orleans. Little second. You know what I'm saying spread diseases like a what the hell? Total STD rates of one little one thousand one hundred fifty eight point nine per one hundred thousand people. Damn, man. There the chlamydia rate was seven hundred thirty point one per one hundred thousand people, while the gonorrhea rate stood at a staggering three hundred fifty four point five percent. A hundred thousand residents. Let's see how. However, the data analysts uncovered that Mississippi was a state with the worst overall STD infection. Why? Because the earth was given into the hands of the weekend. I got some I got some steel frame. Just hold on. But I want, I want to read this, though. I want to read this, though. Let's get this, Leviticus. And I, then I ain't gonna be too, when I when I seen that right there because I'm like, I'm like, what the hell? Damn, near everybody walk around in America got a damn disease. You see? That's why you can't be walking around all promiscuous. And Israelite men, be careful of messing with these eights to the Izzos, man. They're messing with everybody. They're messing with the animals and all that. Leviticus chapter 19, verse 20. That's why the scriptures tell you to keep your daughter in straits, you know what I'm saying? Don't give her too much liberty to be gotten. I'm pretty sure a brother's probably putting that in the chat too, you know what I'm saying? Uh, over, over much liberty, man. Keep her in straits. Keep a, keep a close eye over your daughter, man. You see? Cause look, look, cause everybody knows saying this is what happens. I'm saying when you got see, and they, their leaders are Cardi B. You know what I'm saying Gloria. You know what I'm saying um, Sakushi or whatever her name is Sakasha, whatever that name. Sukahana. You know what I'm saying the, these are their leaders. Um, Nicki Minaj. You know what I'm saying first to start off with Lil Kim. You know what I'm saying nothing but whore them, and, that, and that's what the elites want to push forth. He want all our daughters. You know what I'm saying to be whores, prostitutes. You know what I'm saying look, that bad bitch. Them the ones that spreading the damn diseases, man. Oh, sexy red got big ass um herpy bumps on her damn lips, but everybody wants to be like a yo. Only thing you got people just walking around, you know what I'm saying these these titty poppers walking up and down the street singing this BS, man. But Leviticus chapter 19, verse 29, it reads, Do not prostitute thy daughter to cause her to be a whore. We're supposed to have no whores among the daughters of Israel, nor sodomites among the sons of Israel, man. All right? We're supposed to be the standard of how to live. But that's why two-thirds of our people got to go, man. Got to go. Do not prostitute thy daughters. And look, this is this among, you know what I'm saying, um, gonorrhea, chlamydia. And, and I, I think it was one more, you know what I'm saying? They ain't even came out with the reports on HIV, you know what I'm saying? Of which state is the highest on that. You just type it in. I, I bet it's astounding. It's astounding. To cause her to be a whore. Do not prostitute thy daughter. To cause her to be a whore. Least the lamb fall to whoredom. Look, look, henceforth going right back here. Henceforth going right back here. Let's go just stroll to the top right quick. This is what happens when the land is full of whoredom. This is exactly what happens. You have you have cases, states with the highest SED. This is outrageous. This is outrageous, man. But oh yeah, but the men, you know what I'm saying? But then they mad at the passport bros, you know what I'm saying, that they getting the hell out of here and finding women cross seas that they ain't gotta really worry about too much. And you got women cross seas with, with, with sexual transmitted diseases, but not like over here in Babylon. You have a better chance of going cross seas, you know what I'm saying? Having look having protective sex, of course, you know what I'm saying, with a woman than over here, man. These these women are foul, yo. They foul, they stink, they they they're not even they 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 so damn horny, they're not even going to the clinic. These women, especially down there in Houston, one hundred and twenty four percent 
percent. I'm saying um, spike. I'm saying in, in, in sexual transmitted, uh, sexual tra- uh, transmitted diseases. Look, they're not even going. They so horny. They're not even going to the clinic. They get checked out, man. Remember my body, my choice. Leviticus nineteen twenty nine. Do not prostitute thy daughter to cause her to be a whore. Least the land fall to a whoredom and the land become full of wickedness. Every damn man, everybody walk around. I'm saying it's a walking damn disease, man. You got to be careful, man. Be careful, Israelite, man. So stop being promiscuous out here. Oh, yeah, I got I got another scripture. I, I want to get this right quick too. And then I got some other. So as soon as I seen that article right there, I'm like, yo, what the hell? All these different states. I'm in North Kalaki, you know what I'm saying? North Kakalaki, you know what I'm saying? And look, shit, shit is crazy up here. I know them down, I know them damn uh them clinics, you know what I'm saying? Them health clinics be packed early in the damn morning, man. You see? Let's get this right quick. Yeah, I want to get this still in the book of Deuteronomy. Deuteronomy 23, 17. You Israelite man, Michael Jackson even told you, be careful who you love, all right? You see, dude, strap the hell up, man. Strap the hell up, man. You, you ain't no wives out here, man. Ain't no wives out here. Now, you got the whole for elect lady, you know what I'm saying? She in the cut, you know what I'm saying? But, uh, but other than that, man, that's why, that's why the majority of the Israelite women got to burn in that fire. They got to burn. And, and two-thirds of the men, too. They got to burn, too, because they around here spreading down diseases. You see, taking diseases back home and all this man this is crazy man this is what happens when the wicked rules the earth deuteronomy 23 17 there there should be no whore of the daughters of israel but what are they pushing though what is what is cardi b pushing i'm saying what is um megan a stallion pushing what is um sexy red pushing what is glorilla pushing you know what i'm saying um, just, just just riding the cock carousel all day don't don't, don't settle down and, and get your husband when the script say the, the younger women are supposed to marry guide the house you know what i'm saying look look bear children guide the house and submit to her husband, but instead of submitting to their husband, you know what I'm saying, they rather submit to the streets, you know what I'm saying, in the majority, so be careful Israelite men, because the majority of these women walk around, they, they fucking got disease, all, they infested, man, like a beehives, they straight up infested, man, Deuteronomy infested, Deuteronomy infested, Deuteronomy chapter 23, just something quick, right quick, man, quick hit, Deuteronomy 23, 17, there shall be no whore of the daughters of Israel, that's why nobody don't want to hear the Bible, that's why the Bible is not being taught in school, you know what I'm saying, the Bible really ain't being taught in church either. They got a Bible in the church, but the church does not teach the Bible. They say you can come as you are. When the scriptures say you got to be converted. You see, in order to be healed, you got to be converted. You got to change your ways. That old man, that old woman, you got to you got to keep that old man, that old woman ass every day. You know what I'm saying? You know, you can't just um, succumb to the, to the flesh. You see, you got, you got to fight that flesh every day. No, a sodomite, a peanut butter chaser of the sons of Israel. And ain't that the only thing they pushing? The only thing they pushing, you know what I'm saying, is whoredom and, and, and sodomy. That's all they pushing. And this is what happens, you know what I'm saying? And as a judge of the people, so it's themselves. Brothers can put that up. I, I want to get this, though. This is Proverbs. Just something quick to them at work, too. I'm, I'm, I'm about to roll out. Proverbs chapter 29. Verse 2, and it reads, when the righteous are in authority, the people rejoice. But when the wicked bear fruit, the people mourn. It's a whole lot of people walking around with diseases and ain't telling no damn body. You see? But, 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 but I digress. Let's get into some other articles. But Israelite men, just be careful. I, I took some screenshots, you know what I'm saying, of some articles. And I'm going to just go through them right quick. Listen to this. California father reconnected with his son's estranged adult son. Look, look, then he bulged the sleeping man with a sludge hammer. You, you see that shit? See that sludge hammer? I, 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 I want to blow that up. I want to blow that up. Let's, look at that damn sludge hammer. He got reacquainted, you know what I'm saying, with his, with his son's son, you know what I'm saying? And then, then he put, look at this damn devil right here. This, this is a damn demon right here. Once again, the earth is given to the hands of the wicked, right? It says, when the righteous are in authority, the people rejoice. But the, when the wicked bear fruit, the people mourn. Look, these people are psychotic. These people have really lost it. And, and bear with me. Hell, everybody, this is right here. You know this call right here? This is called a spirit that was created for vengeance, man. All right? What does it say again? California father reconnected with his son's estranged adult son. You see, his son had an adult son. Then he bought, he bought the the, the sleeping man with a, if I'm saying that word, boys, boys, I did, you know what I'm saying? The sleeping man with a sludge hammer. That's why you can't go to everybody's house, man. You can't go to sleep in everybody's house. Look, what a damn sludge hammer. You do, 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 boom, boom. You know, you know, she was skeeting everywhere. She, look, ske- while he was asleep, man, she was skeeting. Look, he, he didn't have no chance. He, look, he didn't stand no chance, man. You, you sleep. 
you sleep and somebody just pound caking on your head. As a matter of fact, let's just let's get that scripture. This is one of them evil angels, man. It's one of them evil. Just something quick too, man. I'm all, I'm already at work. Just something quick. I took some. I'm not even gonna be able to get through all of them because a whole lot. Let's let's get this. Psalm chapter seventy eight, verse forty nine. He cast upon them the fierceness of his anger, and, no, and nobody perished being innocent. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He was asleep, but so what? The Lord is like, yeah. He so so he was asleep. He was he was better off getting deleted in his sleep. You see, he, he most definitely didn't want to be woke. I'm saying, feeling that sludge hammer come down on that head. Psalm in the face, in the face. Put up the sludge hammers, brothers and enemies. Psalm chapter seventy eight, verse forty nine, and it reads, He cast upon them the fierceness of his anger, wrath. And and indignation and trouble. You know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah, and going right back to that article, you know what I'm saying? About them damn women, they leaking. They leaking every day. They leaking everywhere. Shit, damn, 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 muscle stains and everything, if you know what I mean. He's Psalm chapter 78, verse 49. He cast upon them the fierceness of his anger, wrath, and indignation, and trouble by sending evil angels among them. So, so that, that dude, son, the Lord sent the evil angel, meaning a left hand spirit, you know what I'm saying, against his son. The, look, the Lord did all that, man. Should that be, remember, should that be evil in the city and the Lord have not done it? I want to get this dude to write me 32. Let's just get this right quick. Like I said before, this is going to be something quick, too. It ain't going to be nothing long. I'm already at work. Shh. I'm already at work. Shh. Deuteronomy chapter 38, verse 39. It is. See now that I, even I am he, and there is no God with me. I kill and I make alive. I wound and I heal. Neither is there any that can deliver out of my hand. Let's get another one. Let's get another one right quick. All the issues of death come from the Lord. All the issues of death, no matter which way a person gets taken out, it's all being orchestrated by the God of the Bible. Psalm chapter 68, verse 20. We're just going to roll right quick. Psalm chapter 68, verse 20. And it reads, he that is our power is the power of salvation. And unto the Most High, Yahweh, <clears throat> through his only begotten Son, Yahweh, shall be long the issues from death. So no matter which way a person gets taken out, it's all being orchestrated by the God of the Bible. Let's get Isaiah 45. We're just going to keep rolling right quick. Bring out some scriptures, and we'll bring out a couple more articles. I, I took some steel frames, and then, we, then we're gonna wrap it up. A whole lot going on. Hell, at the Popeyes, you know what I'm saying? You had a person get banged, you know what I'm saying? At the damn Popeyes through the damn drive through window, look all up there in Philadelphia, you know what I'm saying? Motherfucker just breaking shit, busting in the shit, still in liquor, still in TVs, all that shit. I say, it is. Wars popping off, earthquakes everywhere, storms everywhere. Hell, New York being flooded the hell out. Look, 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 look the ancient plagues of Egypt is hitting America, man. And you Israelites are playing a damn around. The Lord got something. He got that judgment prepared for your black asses, man. Isaiah chapter 45, verse 7. I form the light and create darkness. I make peace and create evil. I, the Lord, Yahweh, through its only begotten Son, Yahweh, shall I do all these things. So when the scriptures tell us, the scriptures command us to seek the Lord, it said, make no tarrying. To turn it to the Lord, don't put it off from day to day. Because look, soon you start putting it off from day to day, this is this what happens. This is what happens in thy security when you land in the damn bed, in the damn fetal position, having a good old dream. That's how you know somebody goes oops upside your damn head with a sludge hammer. Here it is. Next article. Next article. Grandpa gets deleted after being stung by a swarm of bees. Killer bees on a sword. Killer bee. Bzzz. 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 Damn, killer bees on a sword. These, these spirits create a and brothers can put the bee mojos up there too. No saying put the put, put the hornets up there, put the bee, put the yellow jackets up there, put whatever kind of bees you can bzzz, kill a bees on the swamp. Damn grandpa gets deleted. He, they wanted to delete his grandpa. They wanted to delete his granddaddy. Grandpa gets deleted after being stung by swarm of bees on his porch after accidentally disturbing nests. Look, look, mind your damn business. No saying? Don't worry about something that don't pertain unto you. You should have left the damn bees alone. You mess with the bees, you get stung by the bees. Bzzz, bzzz, bzzz. Look, look, look all them damn bees right there, man. Look, killer bees on a damn sword. Call them Wu-Tang. Call them Wu-Tang. De look at granddaddy. Look through in the damn way. That's somebody's granddaddy. Granddaddy, you look through it. You probably fell to the ground and them damn bees were stinging the shit out your ass. Yo. All the issues of death. I want to get that again. All the issues of death come from the Lord. Isaiah chapter 45 verse 7. I form the light and create darkness. I make peace and create evil, meaning bad times. That was a bad time for Grandpa. I, the Lord, Yahweh, through his only begotten Son, Yahweh, shall I do all these things. That's why it's so much that we fear. Fear the God of the Bible and depart from evil, man. You see, the escape, the, um... 
What is it? To escape the snares of death, man. You see, seek the Lord. Let's get, let's get Amos. Let's get Amos right quick. Should there be evil in the city? And the Lord says it's going to be worse than that. You got bees deleting people. You got alligators deleting people. You got monkeys. You got gorillas. You got every damn thing. Lions, tigers, bears, oh my. You know what I'm saying? Everything evils. Nothing but damn evils. You know what I'm saying? Attacking these people, man. Amos chapter 3, verse 6. Shall a trumpet be blown in the city and the people be, and the people not be afraid? I'm going through it right quick because I got to get back to work. I'm, look, look. I'm already on the clock. Shh. Don't tell nobody. I'm already on the clock. Shh. Yeah. Is. Amos chapter 3 verse 6 Shall the trumpet be blown in the city And the people not be afraid Shall there be evil meaning bad times in the city And the Lord Yahweh through his only begotten son Yahweh Shai have not done it Should the Lord power do nothing But he revealed his secret And to his service the privacy. So the Lord got these different creatures you know what I'm saying? Attacking these people man Look what, 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 what I want to get He was on might, well, might as well get this All kind of scriptures going through my head But I ain't going to be able to make it too much longer Second Ezra the 14th chapter Verse 16, and it reads, For yet greater evils than those which thou hast seen happen shall be done hereafter. You're going to have more ego attacks, you know what I'm saying? You're going to have shit, people getting torn to pieces by rhinos. You're going to have one dude got stomped out when a rhino attacked him. And then right after that, you know what I'm saying? A damn alligator attacked him. This shit is crazy. One thing, what it would say, War to them that desire the day of the Lord, you know what I'm saying? What is the end for you? Is that fleeing from a lion, running into a bear, getting away from the bear, getting someone saved, and then a damn serpent, and by you come on, this is going down, man. For yet greater evils, bad times, greater bad times than those which thou hast seen happen shall be done hereafter. For look how much more the world shall be weaker through age, so much the more shall evils, evils increase upon them, meaning bad times increase upon them that dwell therein. Man. And look, you can't escape it. There's a thing about it, you can't escape it, man. The, the damn bees deleted his damn grandpa, man. The, the, straight up deleted his ass, man. Second Ezra chapter 8. Verse 50, a couple more articles, a couple more scriptures, and then we're going to wrap it up, man. Second Ezra chapter 8, verse 50. Remember, make no terror to turn to the Lord. You see a damn beehive, leave it alone. Look, and then the bees pretty much got the mind of an elephant. The bees, don't forget, shit, you, you delete a whole lot of bees. If one bee escape, he going to remember your face. And look, look, he going to remember his face until he gets deleted from all the face. He's going to go grab a band of his brothers, you know what I'm saying, from another state, and they're going to come back, and they're going to sting your ass to deletion. Bzzz. They're going to just keep stinging your ass. They're going to like pay back as a bitch. Bzzz. Sting, sting them, sting them, sting them, sting Sting they ass to the leash. It is. Second Edwards chapter 8 verse 50. For many great miseries shall be done to them that in the latter time shall dwell in the world because they have walked in great pride. Only thing, all because they walked in great pride. Only thing Grandpa had to do was leave the damn bees alone. Leave the damn bees alone. Bzzz. Kill the bees on a swarm. It is. Next article. Zoo, look, look, zookeeper. Put up the lion mode. Mojo's brothers put up their ferocious lion mojo. Arr, arr, arr. Zookeeper maul to deletion by lion after forgetting to lock the damn cage door. He forgot it. Is. That's one thing you don't never do. You don't forget to lock the damn cage door. Don't let nothing distract you. You lock that damn cage door. Well, this is arr, 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 arr. the damn lion said, I want a damn snack. And guess what? You're the snack. It is. In the news, he forgot to lock the damn door. A Japanese zookeeper has been deleted. Look at that damn lion. Look at that damn lion. In the kingdom, we're going to have some lions as pets and all that, man. We just have them roam around inside the house. Things of that nature. Just going on different walks with us. I, I want a couple of lions, man. I want a whole I want a whole pack of them. I want lions on my on my land, on my property, or whatever. The Lord bless me with, Lord willing. I want lions and tigers and bears every damn where. Just walk around free. Free as a bird, man. Come as you please it is a japanese zookeeper has been deleted after after being attacked by a lion as he tried to feed it as he tried to feed it the lion said no no i want you i want you would it say whatever his name is 53 was found unconscious and bleeding from his neck inside part of the lion's enclosure at Sakar Safari Park in Fukushima region on Thursday. Hey, remember them lions, no saying drunk some of that damn Fukushima water, no saying. So you you know they ain't acting right right about now either. Another spirit created for it. put up the lion mojo's brother. The Lord sent an evil angel. It was a spirit on that lion. Matter of fact, let's just get it right quick. I might as well get it. Let's just get it. Second Ezra the 15th chapter. Let's just get it. The Lord said, Go, I gotta get 
this again, 2nd Andrews chapter 8, verse 50. For many great misery shall be done to them that in the latter times shall dwell in the world because they have walked in great pride. You should have locked that damn gate. You should. Who, who left the damn gate open? Who left the damn gate open? You see? It is evils. Remember, evils and only evils. Remember, they seek your peace, but ain't nothing. Uh, New York being flooded out right about now. The damn subways coming all down the damn um, what they call them shits? Um, uh, them shits Bill Cosby was in. I can't think of them shits. I'm not from New York. So rock chapter thirty nine. Brown, brown houses, I think. Brown stones, brown houses, brown, doo doo browns, brown something. I don't know. It is. But one thing I know is this right here. There be spirits that are created for vengeance. Sirach 39, 29. Sirach 39 and 28. There be spirits that are created for vengeance. That lion was one of them. Those bees was one of them. That dude with the sledgehammer was one of them, which in their fury lay on storage. It ain't even got to no articles yet, which in their fury lay on storage. That dude with that sledgehammer, damn sure laid on some sore strokes, right? In the time of destruction, they part their force. And appeased the wrath of him that made them. Yeah, the spirits created for vengeance, right? Fire and hell and famine and death. All of these were created for vengeance. Teeth of wild beasts. That lion was teeth of wild beasts. And scorpion, serpents, and the sword punishing the wicked to destruction. Punishing the wicked to destruction. They shall rejoice in his commandment. And they shall be ready upon earth when need is. And when their time has come, they shall not transgress his word. Let's go back to the articles. Even and only, and I'm not going to be able to get to none of the scriptures on the board, but the Water Brothers, for all y'all putting them up there. Let's go to the next article. Once again, zookeeper mauled to deletion by lying after forgetting to lock the damn cage door. For all you zookeepers, lock the damn cage. Look, for all you zookeepers, you know what I'm saying? Um, what do they say? You want a tip? I'll give you a tip. Lock the cage door. Here it is. Next article. Little woman, 31, banged and deleted while traveling from Texas to Louisiana in apparent road rage incident. Remember, running that damn mouth. Running that damn mouth, man. You see what happens? Look, once again, let them have it. If a person comes riding past you, all, all, all crazy. Let's, let's see. Um, soft answer. Is that it? See a soft answer. If someone come past you flying and shit, or somebody, you know what I'm saying, honking their horn and all that shit, or somebody passes you, don't honk that damn horn. Don't run your damn mouth. Don't say nothing. Let them go on about their damn business. Cause that's a spirit. That's a demon on these people, man. And here, here it is right here. Probably because that woman known for running her damn mouth. You women gonna get enough for running your damn mouth. Still ain't you still ain't learned yet. You ain't learned yet. You're gonna learn a valuable lesson. A silent and loving woman is a gift from the Lord. Proverbs 15 and 1. A soft answer. So turn up away wrath, you see, but grievous words stir up strife. What the hell you pass me for? No, say, what the hell you cut me off for? Come on, man. You know these people, mouse man. See, your, your mouth gonna write a check that your ass can't cash. Here it is. A soft answer turn up away wrath, but grievous words stir up anger. We gotta let wisdom meet us in every thought. We gotta, we got the wisdom. We better learn how to use it. Woman 31 banged and deleted while traveling from Texas to Louisiana in apparent road rage incident. And I think she she was going on a trip. You women better learn how to stay your ass at home. All this jet setting, all this driving from one state. I got to go to the club in this state. I got to go show myself off. Sit your ass in the house. If she would have, if she would have went home, if she would have went to work, got off work and went home, she wouldn't have had to worry about no damn road rage. It is. Let's go. Look, look, look at this shit. Texas Popeye employees selling drugs on the clock. Bangs at customers trying to spoil him. Police say it, it won't over no damn um fries. It was the dude was selling drugs. Drugs. That dude right there was selling drugs at damn Popeyes. Know what I'm saying? And somebody was trying to know what I'm saying R R O B him. I mean to spoil him, you know what I'm saying? And that saying no. He he went back, you know what I'm saying? He didn't have his blicky on him at first. He went back off the camera, grabbed the blicky, came back, and started popping off through the damn drive-thru. They making drug sales, had the damn drive-thru. It is Texas Papa. So the Lord, you know what I'm saying? Uh, look, look, the Lord that man turn from your wickedness, Israel. Repent. Texas Papa employees selling drugs. He's selling drugs at damn work. He's selling bags of marijuana at work. On the clock, bangs at customer trying to rob him. Please say a Popeye's new hire, a, a Popeye's new hire in Texas was allegedly selling marijuana. He was selling that. He was selling that gas. You know what I'm saying while on the clock, well, while on a damn clock, and, and bang at a customer trying to rob him during during a drug deal. Authorities said, you see.
So that's what it was all about. You can't even go to Pop. It's always something happening in that damn Popeyes. We that damn man, man, look and a damn and, and another um incident having that jack in the damn box, man. It is. Let's go here. Fifty two deleted, fifty injured and suspected. You see it. Um, boom, 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 boom. You can put you can put up the boom, boom, booms. You know what I'm saying on Eid, um, worshippers in Pakistan. Look, that's why the God of the Bible is to be feared. Psalms um ninety six, Psalms ninety six four and five. And we're just gonna go through the articles right quick. Just over. And over dad and 16 year old daughter uh struck by lightning man the dad and a, his the daddy and the damn 16 year old daughter struck by lightning they were struck by lightning while hunting she ends up being deleted days later i wonder who did that right there i wonder who who brung the lightning who brung the lightning who brung the storm we're just gonna get it right quick isaiah Let's just get it right quick. Isaiah 29. Let's just get it. It is. Look, her, her and her daddy was struck by damn lightning, man. The Lord, the Lord ain't playing. The Lord is not playing. Isaiah 29 and 6. Thou shalt be visited of the Lord of hosts, the Lord of armies, Yahweh, through his only begotten son, Yahweh Shai, who you eagerly call God and Jesus with thunder. What comes out the thunder? Lightning. And with earthquake and great noise, with storm and tempest and the flame of devouring fire. So who deleted this, who deleted this man's daughter? The Lord. Dad and 16-year-old daughter was struck by lightning while hunting. She gets deleted days later, man. You see? Would it say whatever her name is and her dad were hunting on Tuesday? On a Tuesday, when lightning struck a tree, hitting them. Boom, 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 boom. That lightning is, is, is scary. It, it hit them, man. It struck the tree and it hit them. Hit it is. Next article. I'm just keep rolling right quick. As many as 12 bodies, 12 bodies, man, found strewed around Monterey in northern Mexico. You see? Uh, mutilated corpses, little, little, little spirits created by villains are active. Mutilated corpses and and severed body parts, body parts severed damn well. Ass, necks, lungs, you name it, man. Heads, heads going, nose pieces, ears, you just name it. Body parts have been found dumped in seven locations across the northern Mexican Mexican city of Monterrey. You know what I'm saying, and its suburbs, including some of the wealthiest districts in the county. It don't matter because. Is proper not in the day of wrath as many as 12 bodies, you know what I'm saying? Been strewed, been found strewed all, all over the damn ground from state to state, from city to city, from, from fucking city block, neighborhood to neighborhood. It is. That's why we must fear. Remember, make notarian hiker 61 plunges 150 feet to deletion from popular North Carolina Park Vis Vista. You know what I'm saying? What the hell is you doing up? You 61 years old. You should have had your ass in that damn house. But you went up 165 feet, you know what I'm saying? Up in the damn air on a damn on a damn park, you know what I'm saying? Venture. You fell 150 feet to your damn delete. A damn woman, a 61-year-old damn Edomite, you know what I'm saying? Fell to her damn deletion. It is. Let's keep going. Look, another zookeeper, right? Now that's the same one. Look at the damn, look at the damn. That's the earth from earlier. Look at that damn lion. I want one just like that. I want one just like that. And I, um, guess what? I'm gonna feed him. I'm gonna feed him sleazy ease every day. Every day he's gonna he's gonna see what some white meat tastes like. Some Edomite meat tastes like, right? Let's let's, let's go. Husband here screaming. As wife's co-worker naps her outside Texas home, FBI says, ain't that some shit? The husband hears his damn wife screaming, a damn co-worker, the person that she works with, the person that she that she's too familiar with, the person that she been running her damn mouth to is up um, napping her, you know what I'm saying, outside the damn Texas home, but we're going to keep going. We're going to keep, daily, daily um, violence continues in Sweden, three people deleted in overnight banging and, and, in, and an explosion. You see, all of all over the earth. The Lord said throughout the four corners, I'm bringing plagues throughout the four corners of the earth, man. It ain't just here in America. It's everywhere. Now we in down Sweden, you know what I'm saying? With, with violence is every damn well. Evils and evils. The Lord said all over the earth. You can see none but evils, man. Let's, let's roll on. Mi Missouri man accused of deleting his wife. You see that? Another damn woman delete. Another one bites the damn dust. Missouri man accused of deleting his wife and writing disturbing word in B-L-O-O-D on her body and he wrote a damn message. 
corner. He didn't put a message in the bottle. He put a message on the damn body. He didn't put a message in the bottle. He put a message on the damn bottle. It is used in B L O D. Look, look, look. Shh, you women. Shh. Men are tired of it. Men are tired of you going to damn work, running your damn mouth, telling your damn co workers what your men like. You know what I'm saying? What time he get off work? You know what I'm saying? How much he makes at work? Uh, what, what, that's what, stop running your damn mouth. Because look, 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 because men are tired of it. Now the Lord's putting the spirit. Look, every, every time I do it in the news, it's more women being deleted on the apps than the men. Because you know right there that the Lord is tired. The Lord is tired. You've been running your damn mouth since the damn um, early 60s, man. Uh, 50 some years of running your damn mouth. How long did you think the Lord was going to put up with it? Now he's, now he's shutting that shit up, man. This woman right here won't run her damn mouth anymore. She won't run her mouth anymore. Missouri, his, Missouri man accused of deleting his wife. He wanted to delete his wife. He wanted to delete his wife. You know what I'm saying? Going right back to St. Matthew, the 10th chapter, man, down in 34 and 35. A man's foe shall be they of his own household. And what it say? He deleted his wife and, and writing disturbing word in B L O D on a damn body or my body on top of her damn body. Eesh. What else? Rhode Island man gets life sentence for deleting his girl. A damn another one. A damn this. But ain't nobody scared. Remember, a boss bitch, you know what I'm saying? I ain't got to listen to nobody. You ain't my daddy. The Lord is tired of that shit. He been tired of that shit. A little a woman was created to submit to a man. And every woman, we say it all the time through the spirit of your how about Shemel Shah. Every woman on the face of the earth will submit to a man eventually, one way or the other, whether you get deleted on this side and you come back in the kingdom and you submit or you submit now. Look, look, you be better off submitting now. Rhode Island, man. Wait, we raid up and down Rhode Island, quiet ass Rhode Island. You know what I'm saying? Rhode Island, man, gets life in prison for deleting girlfriend. You know what I'm saying? His girlfriend, girlfriend, hiding body in the damn fridge. He hit it. Is. He hit the damn body in the damn fridge. Man, let's see what else. And, she, and look, and look, and she threw. You mean to tell me somebody was dating this ninja? This ninja look through his shit, man. What the hell is wrong with you, Israelite man? You can, you damn, you that damn desperate. It is, it is, damn it, she threw. Damn it, she threw. It is. California man gets 116 years in prison for banging girlfriend. A damn another one. A damn another one. Is. He banged his damn girlfriend and her teenage daughter. Damn it, man. He didn't give a damn. Well, what it saying? A California man has been handed a life sentence of 116 years to life in a state prison for banging his girlfriend and teenage daughter, leaving the girl in quadriplegic. Man, the, 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 the people ain't giving a damn. Let's, let's see what else. Girl 16 who was struck by lightning. That's the picture of the girl that was struck by lightning. She gone. The Lord don't give a damn about a pretty face. In the news, Massachusetts man hacked five popos. Look, look, how the hell did this sleazy eat? Hack, you know what I'm saying? This eat them, eat them my privileges right about now. You know what I'm saying? This is s -s -s shit. Jake won't even get close to the damn popo. If they even see Jake with a damn weapon in his damn hand, they're going to boom, 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 boom. See, this eat them my pr um, privilege right here. This is what you call white privilege right about now. You know what I'm saying? When you get the fucking hack, you know what I'm saying? Five uh, popos and you, and, you look, and you get to live to talk about it. Massachusetts man, a uh, uh, fucking easy, a sleazy, easy. little little hacks five cops after leading them on chase crash into home. You mean to tell me he lived to talk about this shit? Now he's locked up. That's dude, right there. That's him in the hospital with a damn hospital gown. But but the Israelite man, he wouldn't have been able to go on high speed. As soon as they would have seen him with that damn knife, they would have blasted his ass down. But but their day is coming. It, it just shows you who, who's ruling the earth right about now and who could commit crime and get away with it and make it to the damn hospital and make it to the damn cell. Uh, Jake is not making it to the cell. Little Negro Latin or Native American Indians have a, have a damn knife in their damn hand or either have a damn cell phone in their hand. The police are going to say, I thought it was a knife. I thought it was a blicky. Boom, boom, boom. They're going to open up the whole damn clip. It's going to be like 15 popos. Open up the damn clip on Jake. But this dude right here, he gets to go to the hospital. Look, look, with no damn injury. Ain't no, ain't nothing on his damn fight. A couple of um, bruises from when he crashed the car. That's what I'm saying. This shit going to go soon, come. Man, was four dozen liquor stores in Philly closed a day after mob looted at least 18 shops. Them, them Jake wanted that damn liquor. Jake still in liquor. Jake still in shoes. Jake, Jake going up in the restaurant, still in burgers, hopping over the counter, still in mustard packages and all that shit. It is. All fine wine and good spirit liquor stores are set to close Wednesday in Philadelphia after Tuesday night's mass looting where 18 different store locations were broken into. The Philadelphia Inquirer report. Look, 
look, look, we don't give a damn. As long as you Israelites ain't out there doing that nonsense. Look, 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 look at this shit right here. What it is, woman allegedly decapitates father of her children, puts head in the damn trash, and you put you Israelite men better be careful. I'm saying the spirits is only these, these damn demons out here. Be careful, ain't nothing but demons out here. She decapitated this dude. I'm saying put his head in the damn trash. Put it. You got to have a spirit on you. This is a spirit creative event. You got to have a different spirit on you to take someone's head off and put it. To, to, to even think about taking somebody's heads off. I'm saying, and they said they rejoice when they do it. The scripture said they rejoice. These spirit created within, they rejoice when they do it. All wickedness is little to the wickedness of a woman. Let the portion of a sinner fall upon her. It is woman allegedly is woman allegedly decapitates father of a child, puts head in the damn trash can, man. Put it in the damn trash can. It is what else, man? Look at this special ed teacher and ex clown accused of deleting why he did that. He did and a damn another by golly whiz. There's a damn another one. He's look, look, he was a clown, but he won't fooling around on that day. He was a clown, but he damn sure wasn't fooling around on that day. <laughs> Deleting wife as she was on the, on the phone calling her down 911 begging for help. No, say the Lord said, look, you ain't my friend. Just get it. Let's just, get, let's just get a scripture right quick. One more scripture, and then I'm gone, Israel. I'm gone after this. Is, the Lord said, look, you would not be able to escape from the evils. Just get this. And uh, though they cry, try calling for help. 911, 911. You saw what he did, man. He he looked like he ready to, to delete something, too. Jeremiah 11, 11, and it reads, Therefore, thus saith the Lord Yahweh, through his only begotten son, Yahweh shall I behold, I will bring evil upon them, which they shall not be able to escape. And though they shall cry unto me, because she was called, she was 911. Remember, Flavor Flav said it in the early, in the late 80s. 911 is a damn joke in your town. 911 is a joke in your damn town, man. In it is, which they shall not be able to escape. And though they shall cry unto me, I will not hearken, meaning listen unto them. So that one was on the damn phone calling 911. Pick up the phone. And her damn husband said, nah, nah, not today, not the damn day. He was a clown, but he damn sure won't mess around that damn day. He's James Anderson, 37, you see it, a special education teacher and former clown from Texas has been arranged on a deletion charge for allegedly banging and deleting his wife. He wanted to delete his wife while their three-year-old son was in the house with them. He didn't give a damn about that. He's Look at him. He didn't give a damn damn long ass balloon he didn't give a damn got the damn red top hat he sleazy don't give a sleazy or delete your ass man sleazy don't give a damn sleazy will delete your ass it is seven corpse seven bodies found out the acts of disloyalty within cartel just over and over and over what the hell Detroit woman makes U.S. Marshals 15 most wanted fugitive list for brutal for brutal 2018 deletion dismembering of her boyfriend a damn another another damn woman dismembering her damn boyfriend she was on a America most wanted. So if you see her, you better haul ass. If you see this woman right here, get the hell out of Dodge. If you see this damn woman right here, brothers, do not date her. I'm pretty sure since 2018 to now, somebody done popped her. You know what I'm saying? But just remember, she's she's dismembering every boyfriend that she gets with, especially if she know that you know that you know that she's uh, on the damn run. Just, 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 you got to have a different just a dismembering interest, man. On to the next. Woman allegedly decapitates father of child. Yeah, yeah, we read that. Look, 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 look at these damn ninjas. Look at these damn ninjas. Looters destroy and spoil Apple Store. That's what I'm saying. Stealing damn phones. You know what I'm saying nonsense, man. In downtown Philadelphia, after judge dismisses charges against Edomite police officer who fatally banged a young little ain't ain't nobody innocent. Whoever perished in a young Israelite man. Look, look at these damn ninjas. All you say, black and Every damn well, then you got people recording the shit. This were Brooklyn woman, teenage girl, and dog hack to deletion in Flatbush in East Flatbush. Is another damn woman, her damn daughter, Brooklyn. We're Brooklyn that. We're Brooklyn that. We're Brooklyn that. Brooklyn woman, teenage girl, and a damn dog, and little damn poops. And put up the dog mojos and the knife mojos hack to deletion in East Flatbush apartments. Stay out of Brooklyn, man. Stay out of Brooklyn, Brooklyn. 
Please. And this happened in the damn daytime. Just after 2 p.m., police were dispatched to an East Flatbush apartment on New York Ave, um, near Avenue D. Near Avenue D. Damn it, man. Here with a 37-year-old woman, a 14-year-old daughter, and a damn dog. All deleted, man. All damn deleted to them. Put up the damn chalk mojos, too. Look at the smirking sicko who cut lover's head off and left it in Ben done done um done sp- whatever hood as she's saying ain't this a shit a uh, damn another one a uh, damn another woman left her damn boyfriend here in the damn being look them damn women these women got demons on them man for messing with her for having sex with all these damn different men you got all these damn different spirits on you in the news a uh, damn another one man look, look at this shit jack in the box employee bane's customer over missing fries look at this shit right here look at look at look at, look at big shirt shirley shirt here's Shirley, Shirley, hit me. She looked just like Shirley off um fucking um Roger and rerun. Um what was um what was the damn name of that damn show? I forgot the damn name of it. Was it and no, it ain't happy days. It ain't good times. It's some whatever, man. Shirley. Sh- little Shirley didn't give a damn. Jack Jack in the box employee bangs customers over missing fries. Over some damn missing fries. You can use family claims and lawsuit. Ain't this some shit? Hey, hey Texas family has filed a lawsuit against a fast food chain claiming an employee banged at them in the damn drive through in the damn news. What else? Man arrested, arrested for fatally banging of model another damn woman, 26, over Home Depot parking spot. Over a damn Home Depot spark parking spot. Damn it, man. Give them the parking spot. Give, if somebody comes over with a damn blicky, give them the damn parking spot. Find you another damn parking spot. In the news, it's not that damn damn serious is what else woman falls we, we read that earlier I, I think this is another one no no that that's it Look at, look at this shit. Woman pulls Blicky on another woman during argument at a damn nail shop. Had the damn nail shop run up, run on, run up on the wrong. It, bitch. You know what I'm saying? If you want to, on oh my baby. They always saying that bullshit. They even saying, oh God, oh God, on oh my baby, on oh my mama. Is woman pulls a damn Blicky on the, These damn women walk around with damn heat now. What the hell is going on? It is Proverbs 29 and 2. When the righteous are in authority, the people rejoice, but when the wicked bear rule, the people mourn.